We go inside that Washington home where a family and their housekeeper were brutally murdered. Tonight, we are hearing from the family's other housekeeper, and you'll hear that voicemail from her boss possibly saving her life. Also tonight, we're learning new details about the man now jailed for this brutal crime. Here's ABC's Ryan Smith. Tonight, voices from inside the mansion in Washington, D.C., before the murder of Sava Savopoulos, his wife Amy, son Philip, and their housekeeper Vera Figueroa. Amy is in bed sick tonight and she was sick this afternoon and Vera offered to stay and help her out. Housekeeper Nelly Gutierrez, whose life was likely saved by that voice message from Sava. I can't stop thinking about that day. She is traumatized, telling us she tried to call Vera, the other housekeeper, several times to no avail. That day I called her three times. And for the first time tonight, inside into the suspect, Darren Wint, under arrest, now charged with murder. Michael Babcock remembers meeting him at a cousin's house. He, Darren had come out and was windmilling with the knives, and I went up at that and blocked, and this is where he stabbed me on the wrist. Wint has been described by his own family as hostile and arrogant. And while waiting for trial in that first assault against Babcock, he attacked him again on this bridge. I didn't see a knife this time because it was really small. Uh, if it would have been a little bit lower, the doctors told me that I would have died before I made it to the first hospital. And tonight, investigators are still on the hunt for Wint's suspected accomplices. Wint was with five others when arrested, but why were all five released without being charged with any crime? It's one of the many questions we'll address tonight on 2020, Amy. All right, Ryan, and it is the full hour of 2020. Tonight, mystery in the mansion.